Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99. How you doing? It is Friday. Friday? <laughs> what day is today? No, it's Saturday. Friday was yesterday. May the 30th. Um, we'll be babysitting the grandkids tomorrow. Sorry, it's Saturday. And no, I don't drink. Um, I read an article and I'm like, this is a little, I don't like it. But I don't like it for the reasons that you think I don't like it. Let me back up. It has to do with the IRS, Internal Revenue Service. And for years... So about the IRS and cryptocurrency and getting an audit. But let me give you some perspective. For probably the last 15 to 18 years, quite a long time, I've used my office in my home as a deduction on my income tax. And... I still get friends that say, well, that's kind of dangerous. You might get audited. And I'm like, I don't care if I get audited. What I'm doing is legal. I have a tax accountant that prepares my taxes. It's all legal. I'm not afraid. I don't have any fear of the IRS. I do things by the book. So this article says... Got cryptocurrency? Question mark. Get ready for an IRS audit. I think the title is a little misleading. Basically, the IRS isn't cracking down, as the article would somewhat lead you to believe. And I think it's written by a tax accountant guy. Or woman like trying to get more 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 business or something so it talks about how the IRS treats cryptocurrency the IRS guidance on cryptocurrency again I'm not trying to spread fear or FUD if you're doing things by the book and answering the questions on your tax form I don't see what the big, the big deal is. Now, interestingly enough, the article goes into the letters that the IRS got from Coinbase. Remember that a couple years ago? Well, I've got a friend that actually got a letter from them. And they sent out about 10,000, they call them soft letters. It was like a form letter going, we know that you trade or have hold cryptos. Coinbase told us, because remember there was, there was that court proceeding and the IRS, IRS wanted like everybody's account information and they finally narrowed it down to like a particular tax year, like 2016 or 2017. And of those, they were only allowed a handful that were over like a quarter million dollars of uh, trades in a year. So anyhow, one of my friends got this letter that he read to me over the phone about a year and a half ago, and it was kind of a scare letter. Like, hey, we know that you're you know, holding, trading, or doing transactions in cryptocurrency. Anyhow, my friend's always done it by the books. He's reported his taxes. But when you read this article, don't get fear in the same way that some of my friends over the years have said, Crypto Matter 99, if you're taking an office, your office as an expense, on your income taxes, that's dangerous and you're gonna get audited. I'm like, I don't care, I'm, do, I'm doing it by the book. If you're doing cryptos by the book, don't be misled by the title, got cryptocurrency, question mark, get ready for an IRS audit. Anyhow, Crypto Mentor 99, you know I love you. Thanks for being part of my crypto family and uh, yeah, give me a like or a thumbs up. Love y'all, bye-bye.